Hey y'all. I know y'all looking like, what is up with the mask? Oh my God, y'all. I don't know what happened from, to, from yesterday to today, but your girl is not feeling good. Like my throat is itchy and I'm feeling like, mm -mm, baby, I don't want to go to work tomorrow. I've been cool, you know, my coworkers made me some tea or whatever. I had some soup, but I'm not feeling too well. And today is my mom's birthday and I'm about to take her out to eat to Red Lobster, her favorite restaurant. And I have to get it together. So I called my son to see if we had some medicine in the house. I usually take some mucinex if I'm not feeling, you know, if my throat start feeling itchy or something like that, I'll take like some mucinex or something for it um, to kind of catch it. But I'm literally an hour away from home. I look crazy. I'm sorry, y'all. That was my son calling me, telling me what I should take <sighs> for this itchy throat or not. So he was telling me to make sure I take some zinc he was looking in that cabinet and he's seen that we had zinc. He said, whatever you do, make sure you take the zinc before anything because this is what's going to help you the most. Let me grab my AirPods because I don't know if y'all can hear me. Oh, yes, y'all can. <clears throat> so y'all know my day. My day is traffic. I'm in traffic and uh, trying to get through. And this is what I got to deal with. People want to light cigarettes and smoke cigarettes across the street crossing the street okay i'm gonna give y'all a little bit of this for you oh. my bad y'all i had to move my phone because i don't know i got a little spooked because the police had got behind me i don't know what i'm scared of i ain't doing them but recording the site but uh yeah he told me to use some zinc or whatnot. Use that first and make sure I have something on my stomach before I take anything. My son, he's really like one of them kids. I be telling him like, you need to go to school to be a doctor or something. Cause he very health conscious. He don't play at all when it comes to your health. He's very in tune with his body and understanding what's going on with the anatomy of your body. I listen to him. I know I know he know what he's talking about. He always researching. He always in educating himself on stuff like that. So yeah. I gotta feel better though, because today my mama's birthday and I gotta get turned up for her. You know, we finna go eat. I can't be dry. I can't be all sickly or not. I had to get it together. But I also don't wanna get nobody sick. I don't want I definitely don't wanna get my baby sick. And I don't want to get my mama sick. So those two fragile people, I don't want to get sick. Then I'm not going to be able to go to work. So I got to get it together. I got to get it together, baby. My hair. I just put it up. But my hair get old so fast, but it's getting long. It's growing. It's growing a lot. It's growing a whole lot. But yeah, y'all, it's, it's getting cold outside, right? And you already know, is this man off to say he's sleep? It's getting cold outside, and I um, y'all know when it start getting cold, getting cold, you gotta have your um, you gotta get cuddled. <laughs> nah, let me stop playing. But y'all know, y'all know how it is when it's about to get cold outside. My face looks, my forehead looks so shiny. I don't know what that's about? So here go the crazy part, y'all. Crossing, I mean, turning over here. This is the crazy part. Making this time. Because everybody want to blow their horn. People just want to drive crazy. They want to do what they want to do. Everybody trying to get home, though. Look at this man behind me busting used. Oh, my God. He finna have an accident. Whew. They need to have some crossing guards. Some out here. People with instructing this traffic. All right. Okay. All right. This is a beautiful scenery. Look. Okay, y'all can't see that. Look. Look. 
that's so pretty i love it i love my city i love my city i need to put my camera back for the light change but yeah y'all pretty my i had a pretty good day at work today it wasn't that bad it wasn't that bad you know just got a couple things i gotta catch up on I have a meeting to go to tomorrow um, for a couple of hours. I'm going to go knock that out and come to work. Good thing my meeting is literally close to my house, so I don't have to go that far. Parking is good. I ain't got to worry about that. And um, basically, shit, after that meeting, I'm going to get to work when I get there. So I'll probably go get me something to eat after probably make it to work around one o'clock or so probably two two o'clock that way by the time i get to work i'll be ready to leave back out to go home okay i gotta turn y'all don't be messy let me turn thank y'all okay thank y'all beautiful people they must know i ain't feeling good today is everybody cooperating you just gotta see what this lakeshore drive looking like <laughs> Yep, back on Michigan Avenue. Ooh. I wonder what this bus trying to do. Okay. Maybe y'all need to have me a cocktail. What y'all think? I probably need to have me a cocktail and I'll be okay. I might be okay with a cocktail. Ooh. That's probably what's wrong with me. Let me try some gum. And I need not to eat no gum because that's going to make me hungry. And I'm glad I do have an appetite though. I'm glad I have an appetite because we finna go out to eat and I can't be feeling like I'm not feeling good and then I can't eat. You feel me? Today, I was on Facebook. Oh my God, it was so many people birthday. I'm, I've been saying happy birthday literally all day. I guess when me not feeling good, it's a good time for me to go ahead, go on Facebook and tell everybody happy birthday. Go ahead, comment on everybody's stuff. Because I've been working on that. I've been working on, you know, making sure I engage with my Facebook community and trying to get back engaged with my YouTube community, you know, because we all need that love, you know. We all need that love and attention. But I really got a little tea, y'all. I got a little tea. And I don't know if I want to share because I got, I got people watching this channel. I got people watching this channel, but I got some tea. I got a little tea. Well, I got a lot of tea. I don't know which one I want to spill first. But, um, let me see which one I want to spill. Oh, they having a look. I'm so mad I missed the taste. The taste of Chicago. I missed it. I was going to take my kids. I was planning to take my kids this past weekend. I had it all planned out. Had the money to the side, like, yeah, I'm gonna splurge about 250 at the taste. Because I don't know, like, if it's gonna be expensive, I didn't know what it was looking like. And I knew I wasn't gonna drive, number one. We was gonna get in an Uber, have our little chairs. I was gonna have my little cocktail or whatnot, my little basil. And I was gonna have my youngest with me, and we was gonna, you know, walk around and check all the food out. Not every everything, but we gonna check out the most, everything that kinda, like, grab our attention. Saturday come, everybody, this is what they normally do, though. When it's something that I want to do, they they, they flake. You know, my kids flake. The only person that don't flake on me is my baby. Fat Fat. That's my rider. But she ended up going with her daddy. But I should have just kept her with me. But she she don't, she don't never flaked on me. She down with whatever I'm down with. Like, okay, let's go, mama. But my big kids, they like, uh-uh, Shania, uh-uh, I'm tired. Yeah, no, I'm good. Like, how y'all don't want to go get spoiled? I'm finna go spend all this money on food. Y'all don't want to go. And y'all foodies. Y'all love food. Y'all like food like me. So how y'all don't want to go try some food? Wow. Like, I don't get it. I was so mad. Then I started seeing people on Facebook put, put how lit it was at the taste. And I'm like, Wow. My best friend couldn't go because my goddaughter birthday was that weekend. Then I reached out to my me balls. My me balls couldn't go. Me balls is my cousin. He couldn't go because he had to work. Then my good friend couldn't go because he had some stuff going on. 
I'm like, you know what? Forget it. What did I end up doing? What did I end up doing? Okay, so yep, I ended up chilling. Um, I ended up hanging out. Then I ended up going out to a little club that night. It was a Virgo bash. I ended up going there that night. It was pretty lit, and I got toasted. Oh my god! When I tell y'all, I got so toasted. And it's crazy because I had did a little small little taste of Chicago little thing <laughs> on my own. So I went to this restaurant called Southtown. It's on 71st in Indiana. I love them. They the best fast food restaurant you can eat. And they stay up until about one or two. I'm talking about you want the best chicken Philly fat, best chicken wings fat. Price is reasonable. Time beef's fine. I don't eat time beef, but my friends said they good. But they food is bomb. If you ever come to Chicago and you looking for a fast food restaurant, you know what I'm saying, that's convenient, fast, clean, reasonable, go to Southtown. So I went to Southtown earlier that day before I dropped my daughter off. And I got a chicken Philly. Chicken Philly was bomb. I'm talking about the meat was that was was cooked so well it was the, it was so big and soft and sloppy it was the bomb like always so i had that then i had went shopping and got me and grabbed me some work clothes or whatnot um after i dropped my daughter off i grabbed me some work clothes and then after that i ended up going to get me a getting my basil and having me a cocktail and i was just chilling vibing listening to the music i had my my top off i had this one this I'm one sorry. that's my baby my daughter calling me and i'm trying to finish the story before i forget so i had that top off and i'm chilling vibing by myself because when i'm by myself i only need one off if it's really really nice outside and most of the time i don't even really have it off because i don't be feeling like all that i don't be feeling like putting it on taking out all that sometimes i just be chilling in a car with my windows closed or they be cracked. Anyway, I chilled out or whatever. And then I went home. I went home for a second and I have for because no, actually, I'm sorry, let me bag up. So after I got me got my work clothes, I went home, take my stuff home. So when I get home, my daughter cooked. She had made, I forgot she told me she was gonna cook. So I'm already full from the chicken Philly. But I still was gonna eat because my daughter food is super good. She need to be a chef. She had made a she had made me a loaded sweet potato. So in this loaded sweet potato, it was shrimp, it was tequila lime shrimp, and lobster tail. And a lobster tail. Tequila lime shrimp, lobster tail, and broccoli. Oh when, when I tell you it was so fat, it was fire so i was like okay cool i'm gucci like i ain't eat nothing else no more today i'm super good you know i'm I, I could drink i could kick it i don't need nothing else to eat i could just i could vibe. just vibe and pop my shit so then i left whatever went to go hang out with my mama for a little while before i was getting ready to go hang out at the entrance where the virgo bash was at so um fast forward me and my friend linked up, went to the entrance, and we fucking turned up up in there. I'm going to drop a clip. I didn't really turn up that much, but I was, I was drinking my ass off. Oh my God, I was drinking like crazy. Like, I was drinking like crazy. They didn't have a baby with them, but they had to. Hello. That was the end of the day. That was the end of the day. That was the end of the day. And I was not going to do that. I was not going to do that. Never before. I'm like, damn, it's, it was sweet. It was a trick to that shit because it was sweet ice. You know, and then the cuss was about this big. So I'm like, let's get another one. Let's get another one. We steady going to the bar. The shit was crazy. The, the bar was a whole nother world. I'm talking about bartenders got attitudes. I'm looking like, how y'all bartending? Bartending ain't for everybody because that one bartender had a nasty attitude with my friend. I'm talking about she, my only thing she asked us, she told her what kind of drinks we, we wanted. She made them. The only thing was, my friend asked her, did you put, she said, did you add the, did you put the juice or something? I think she said, did you get put the lemonade in there? She was like, what? And snatched the cup and threw it away and walked away. The bartender. I'm like, whoa, we looking at y'all like, what the? I said, 
wow what's really going on up in here oh it's on my eye i'm looking like what's really going on up in here you know it's not even that deep you was literally just asking her a question and my friend's type of person she'll flip out too but she was still calm she stayed calm the whole time and she was trying to explain to her look i just wanted to know what did you put the juice in there and mind you it's loud so she you know she ended up getting it through to her that that's all she wanted to know and the lady ended up making the drink over which was stupid because you should have never threw it away in the first place she ended up making it over for her and we ended up paying for it going about our business popping our shit so we you know dance or whatever we go back to the bar we went back to that bar when i tell you we went back to that bar that lady didn't look our way she didn't say nothing she was taking everybody orders around us and i was in a good mood i promise you i did not let her take me out of my element out of my space because me i would have went that too but we was really good that night we were i have to give it up for us we did really freaking good i feel like we was tested and we both passed that test because we did not give the energy that that lady was giving and then one even only at that bar we end up so once that lady didn't pay us no mind we went to the other bar but let me I, I forgot to mention when we first got in there we got a drink we got it from it's three bars we got it from the first the first bar that bar the drinks was good the lady was nice but it, the drink one is strong as the second bar so that's why we kept going we went to that bar we was trying to go to that bar again that's what the lady with the attitude was at so once we noticed that she didn't want to, you know, make us a drink or, you know, even acknowledge us, we we brushed it off and we went to the third bar. We went to the third bar and it seems as if that bar, that lady had a problem. It seemed like she had a problem. So I'm like, what's really going on? But it wasn't as bad as the second bar lady. So I'm like, I'm thinking in my head, like, yeah, they texting each other or something. They communicating. Like, we we do nothing wrong to these these ladies. We did nothing wrong to them. We was talking nicely, soft spoken. Even after that second incident, <clears throat> even after that first incident, I mean, I even asked my friend, like, should I tip her? Because I don't like to tip people with nasty attitudes. I just don't do that. But it was just something I was like, should I tip her? She was like, I don't think you should, but go ahead. I was like, you sure? I kept asking her, because I'm like, I like the tip, but I'm like, what's wrong with her? So we couldn't figure it out. I mean, she didn't, not, we couldn't figure it out, but we ended up coming to the, we ended up agreeing to go ahead and tip her. So I tipped her $2. <clears throat> well, she should have got, probably got 50 cents. So anyway, we at the third bar, and the lady looking, you know, she looking, she she helping somebody else, but it seemed as if she was taking too long. But I'm very patient because it's like, okay, I ain't really trying to, I ain't really trying to um, go to the first bar because them drinks wasn't all that. But the lady was nice. So I guess that's where we should have been anyway because I'm just going to go ahead and go to the end of the story. By the time I left up out of this place and got in my car, I was toasted. I was toasted when I tell you toasted. I was throwing up and shit. I'm like, what? I ain't threw up in so long. And I'm looking like, what am I throwing up for? And I ate really good. But your girl was throwing up. I was like, whoa. I tell my friend, like, girl, I cannot drive home. I cannot drive home. This is not happening. She was like, you want to uh -uh. <clears throat> You wanna just leave your car here? And I'll take you? I was like, no, I'm not leaving my car in this parking lot. I don't know these people, trust these people. I ain't doing it, baby. Uh-uh. I'm going to just try to drive this car. <clears throat> yeah, my throat is. I'm going to just try to drive this car. So she was like, you sure? I'm like, yep. And my, I always pray. No weapon formed against me. Shall press the blood of Jesus, baby. I did my prayer. I started the car. And I was like, whoa soon as i hit the gas i was like yeah i'm fucked up <clears throat> so i just turned on some music and what get me going is uh sexy red i don't know this little girl is hilarious to me 
but she get me turned up. I turned on sexy red, baby. And I don't know, I just set up straight and I own the wheel. <clears throat> I own the road. And I just allow God to lead me. And I end up going to her house because her house wasn't that far away from the place. So I was like, that's as far as I can go. I'm not going no farther. Like if I would have went home, that was like a good 25 minutes. Nope, I'm not finna do it. I'm gonna go right here. I went to her house, showered, and fell the fuck out. I woke up at seven o'clock in the morning, got up out of that because I had a test to take. I was like, yeah, I gotta, I gotta go. I gotta get up out of here. I was lit. But that's the end of that story. But yeah, y'all, I'm stuck in traffic again. Have to go pick up my baby. They still doing this one lane thing. But I ain't gonna keep talking y'all y'all. I'll catch y'all when I get that thing. Woo! Go, 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 go. Where the car, mama? Where our car at? Oh my goodness. Oh, it's right there. Where? Where? You have fun today? Where? It's right here across the street. Uh -oh. Take your boot bag off. Take your picture. See that on. Take your boot bag off, Paul. Yes, ma'am. Say hi to my YouTube, Paul. Say hi. They miss you. We finna get ready to go to the gas station. I'm gonna get some gas. Mama Mommy, needs some gas. Huh? It's a leaf on your car. It's a leaf on my car. Yeah. Okay. How was school today? How was school, Mama? Delilah, how was school? What you do? I know it's stuck. I'm gonna fix it when I stop, okay? When I go to the gas station. I'm gonna fix it. How was school, Mama? You ready? Stop looking so mean, little girl. You gotta smile, Mama Boo. You gotta smile, Pippi. Pee. I feel like I'm getting better. I feel like I'm trying to get better, better, better. Cause I got a pretty strong immune system. Especially if I attack it before it get crazy. But I still think I want to put my mask on. The sun bumping today. The sun is shining again today, Mama. What? Why'd you Cause Mama, throat is itchy. You feel okay? Yeah. You hot? Yeah. You can't take your. Oh, I'm supposed to take your jacket off. I'm sorry. Did you? Oh, you know what? Zip it up and see. See if you could zip it up. Okay, now unzip it. Try it again. Don't don't cry, Pooh. Try it again. <laughs> Try it again. All right, now unzip it. Now take your time. Unzip it. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Give me one second. One second. I'm gonna do it. One second, Mama. Oh, I'm hungry now. I think, what you want to eat at Red Lobster Pool? Because I want me some coconut shrimp. What you want to eat? Some who? Who? Stop. 
<laughs> what is that? I want to go eat some. Sh I think I want to eat. I want to eat some shrimp. And I want some broccoli. And I want some salad. I want some biscuits. <laughs> I'm hungry. I'm hungry, my baby. You hungry too. Look at her boot bag, mama. It's pretty. You see her boot bag? She got a pretty boot bag on. Where? Oh, we already drove past. It's she back that way. We already rolled past her already, boo. I didn't see her. I know. She was we was driving too fast. It's okay. You wanna say your sight words today? Yeah. Okay, say your sight words. Okay, spell sad. S A I. You almost finished. E. Good job. <laughs> Good job. Spell look. L O O K. Good job, Mama. Spell up. Good job, baby. Spell it. I T. Yay! Good job, Mama, baby. Spell the. T A. Um. You almost finished. Good job, Mama, baby. Yes, now I gotta call Grady to tell her to come down. Okay, so I gotta make some room in this car so everybody can get in. You can't put your purse on the seat with Grady. Right, I gotta make some room, baby. This is a pretty color. This I love this color lipstick. It looks good. Too bad I don't. Mama, she why is, she, why is she talking to the video? Because it's my YouTube. This mom's YouTube too. Right, this your YouTube too. So you got to talk to them. You got to talk to them. Hi, guys. I'm named Delilah. Today is Granny's birthday. And before we go to Red Lester. Period, Pooh. Now we're going to eat some food. Period, Pooh. And get Granny her gift. She's going to be excited for her gift. We can't look in it yet. Got to wait. Okay. Yeah, we gotta wait to give it to her. But I gotta clean up. We gotta wait to give it to my grandma. We're not going out. Oh, we waiting on Ayo too. Ayo finna come. Ayo finna go to, to Granny's birthday? Yeah. Why is she going to her birthday? Cause that's her grandma too. She wanna go with her grandma. Is she, is she, is she downtown Chicago? No, she's not downtown. She coming from home. I downtown Chicago. You downtown Chicago? Yeah, I downtown Chicago. No, you're not downtown Chicago. You you um in Bronzeville. I was Chuck E. Cheese and Kid Part 2. Yeah. And I was the Little Mermaid. Mm -hmm. My dad said take me. Yeah. You didn't take me to the Little Mermaid. I know your dad that's a Take me? Yes, your father did take you, baby. Oh, hey. Hi, sister! Ooh, okay. Hi, sister! Hey, what is that? That's for, that's, that flower is for Granny? Yes, it is. I miss you. Sweetie. I know you're ready for me to take your pictures, right? She no. not, she so not come on me. What about it? She no. not, I she know. not come on me. Uh, why you come on me. Why you saying that? She not come on me. Wait. We going up, right? No. Oh, she's not here. We gotta hurry up, time ticket. Where's Granny at? I told her to come down. Hi, sister. Baby, I ain't trying to be out all day. I gotta work tomorrow. Oh, I want to. Hi, she will. You don't have no spot right there. Um. Oh. Dying, Shania. You could have went.
went in on, on the other side. You can tell them what you get. Um, What's? <laughs> What's cracking you, too? It's the one and only uh, little my, rat. This, this my too. this my daughter. I was I was sneak this in the bow, y'all. When I said um, this mine what I say? <coughs> Give me kiss. I said something. I forgot what I said. Give me I forgot what I said. About I just pulled up. Where your gift at? And I got. I'm, I'm telling Granny about that. Yes, I am. Wait, hold on, I got sneeze. Uh-uh, you, can't, you, can't uh -uh. you got sneeze outside this car? No, I'm trying to push it out. Oh. You finna try to do that on my vid? That's nasty. Can I get to sit She's gonna sit next to you, bro. Uh, She's gonna sit next to you. So I gotta bring some flowers. Oh, that's pretty. You gotta hurry up and she come down. And I got... Oh, she need to see it. Get out! Get out! Relax. Her chocolate ganache, a chocolate ganache sheet cake. She might be in the front. Ain't nobody, you know, coming like how I'm coming. Here she might be in the front. Yeah, she gonna see that when she get down. Her. She just show what she got. I'm not sure what I got. <laughs> oh, right. right. Yes. Well, this for me and Fessa got. This for me and Fessa. Oh, hold on. You gotta sign that card. Mm. Oh, this is this is zinc that um my son was telling me about y'all that he told me to take. Who the Oh, what up? I'm like, who is that? <laughs> oh my god, it ain't even that much in it. It ain't even nothing in here. You he put it to the side, seeing that was. He mm -hmm. should have just said it wasn't nothing up in here. That's crazy. It's so deep. <laughs> ain't nothing in here. Look at this. Up in here, he should have left that. That's crazy. Let's take it. Now I gotta wait till I eat something. I'm gonna take one of these. What's wrong? Oh, Granny getting in the front. What's your nickname? What's my nickname? What's my nickname? What's my no. what's my nickname? Okay, get back. What's my nickname, Pooh? Let's go, Granny. No. Fefe, what's my nickname? What's my nickname, Fefe? And what's Ao nickname? Sharice. Sharice. <laughs> what's your nickname? Give me kiss. Give me kiss. What's Ao nick? What's Ao nickname? I mean, Yay nickname. Granny should get princess. No, I'm for this. What's A your nickname? Uh, Richardson. Richardson. <laughs> and, and What's your dad's nickname? Huh? What's your dad's nick nickname? March. March. Much. Hello, Risky. Hello. Sad. I told you what it is. Now you know I ain't lying. I'm turned up hot in the booth. Hey. So ask me questions and I ain't got a clue. Oh, like no, Queen, no. all blue. All blue. Oh, oh, you capping on the net? That's a red flag. I see you trying to make me mad. That's a red flag. You ain't taking care of your kids. That's a red flag. Oh, you asking me for money? That's a red flag. Say you cheating on your girl? That's a red flag. Grown back acting like a kid? That's a red flag. So now you taking me for granted? That's a red flag. And now you miss me? Ooh, that's a red flag. 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 Ooh, that's a red flag. That's a red flag. Ooh, that's a red flag.
me eat. Right. <laughs> my, my arms started cramping. That's so rude. Give me that. That bad. I want some, baby. Perfect. You don't want to share? <laughs> you don't want to share, mama? What happened? Now you probably don't. In the hope they should be spent And for a memory ends Of those who left your life For the wonders of all people So let us all begin We know it's not too well But I can hold it in Say it loud as you can Happy birthday to you Happy birthday to you Happy birthday Keep on missing the good parts of my videos. So, huh, we just made it home from where I lost the. It was a bad. But we literally waited 30 minutes to sit down. And we waited an hour. But I ain't gonna even hold y'all. My food turned out real good, but what you got to say about your food? Food was garbage. And I'm mad because. I'm sitting here being looking mad because it took so long. I could have been vlogging, showing y'all what's going on. I'm super mad about that, but my food was fat. And they had inland shrimp going on. So I had coconut and sh um, shrimp scampi. What you have? Uh, blackened and lentil tail salmon, shrimp, nasty burnt fried shrimp, good broccoli, and a small baked potato. Sprinkle. And what kind of cocktail? Though? But um, uh, mint. A mint, read a margarita. You know who told her she can drink, but yeah, it, that that's that 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 was crazy. And then she said, "She want to go to another Red Lobster." No, ma'am. What did you eat? What you have? I was having. I don't know. <laughs> she had fish. She had flounder and shrimp. Did you eat biscuits? Oh, let me tell you, I had like five biscuits. I'm mad and I'm embarrassed that I even said that because we waited so long to eat. We just kept eating biscuit after biscuit. I'm going to be mad. I'm going to pay for that shit. But I'm going to work out. I'm going to work out. I'm tired. I'm, like I told y'all earlier, I wasn't, you know, feeling that well. But I worked it through. I worked it out. But my sweet daughter went and grabbed me another bottle of Mucinex. It's a real bottle. She went to Walgreens for her mama because she love her mama. You love your mama, don't you? You, you love me? Yeah. She went to Walgreens for me even though she don't feel like to give me some mucinex because I got to go to work tomorrow. I got to get out of here. Go she got to go to school. <laughs> I got to go to work. Man, you funny, girl. All right. We got, 
we got money to make and education to make and take and all that good stuff. But I'm gonna drop some little clips in here. I did go on Snapchat. I did do that. I ain't gonna even hold you. I, you know, I gotta go on my Snapchat. But I'm gonna drop some little clips up in here from Real Life Stand. Just the whole of that. I think this music next kicking in, y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and unwind so I can get okay. and have my little one get herself together. She like the you gotta tell her what kind of cake that is. Mm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm cold. I'm cold. Yeah. Um, so, I need to, baby. I don't have time to do that. So, I'm my fact, I'm gonna start right now. This is my morning routine. Mm -hmm. baby, baby girl, baby. And I gotta matter of fact, this these vlogs finna get real juicy because it be too much going on up in this house. I'm not even gonna hold y'all, but I look. Uh, I promise y'all, I ain't had none to drink or nothing, and I look like it. Okay, I gotta help my baby girl. She, <laughs> her shirt's stuck. <laughs> her shirt, don't break your buttons. Oh, it's gonna go down, y'all. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a fight. In 0.2 seconds, it's gonna be a fight. <laughs> it's gonna be a fight in a minute. It's gonna be a fight. But I'm gonna go ahead and let y'all go so I can help my infant get up out her work, her uniform.